Well, if you want to help the United Way mm -hmm. of Cass Clay and stay fit at the same time, then we have a perfect event for you. The first Integrity 5K is this Saturday, and here to tell us how, the, how it benefits uh, United Way of Cass Clay are Travis Christopher and Lindsay Schroeder. So to both of you, thanks so much for being here. Thanks, well, thanks for having, having us. Uh, so 5K, are you guys both avid runners? And uh, I love doing the 5Ks, but I'm not an avid runner. But So how does this uh, run going to help out United Way? Well, we um, came up with an idea to do something fun, get the community together, um, hopefully enjoy, enjoy some nice fall weather. Um, we have a great group of people at Integrity who on our special events committee who came up with this idea and thought, what a better way than to support the United Way. Mm. So let's talk about this money raised mm. to do the run. What is that going to kind of go towards that you guys do year in and year out? Sure, at United Way, we always look for a different way to tell the story and the companies like this who do things differently. It allows us to tell that story, but it also gets more people involved in United Way. And at United Way, we have our four bold goals to reduce hunger, homelessness, help kids, help people be independent, and lift people up out of poverty. And what Integrity Windows is doing this weekend, it allows us to share that, but also have a little fun with the 5K and uh, according to what we were just told here in the last segment, nice weather on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> we hope. so. Tell us more about those four goals. I know you guys have been focused on that now for a little while and making a great impact in our community. What are you seeing happening? How are things going? You know, whenever I present to a business and we do hundreds of presentations in the fall, there really hasn't been a more exciting time to be in this town than right now. You know, with hunger and homelessness, we're starting to work with our housing agencies and shelters to really start measuring things like, are we solving a housing problem in six months? Are people long-term housed? On the helping kids side, we look at mentorship programs. But are they increasing their academic performance? Are they actually having results and lifting people out of poverty? Things like our school supply drive. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, we distribute backpacks, but is it really making a difference with really helping those kids start the first day of school on equal footing? Well, I think that's a good example, too. You know, you guys do something like that where they're getting this backpack, but it's giving them so much more than just supplies. It's giving them the opportunity to start off the same as other classmates. It's giving them the opportunity to go in with confidence. So every little thing you guys are doing, it's kind of building more than just that one little message. Right, yeah. right. And something like this that they're doing uh, with the 5K really lends to that healthy lifestyle as well. Yeah. All right, stay with us. When we come back, we're going to have more about how you can get, be a part of the 5K and obviously make a big impact right here in our community.